Aïe Yo, il est comme tam seveni. Yo, salut, mon soeur. That I will be faithful. More than five times in power. Which means your Eric Aguta Museveni won six elections. Could that then mean he has been in power for more than three decades? Of course, yes. But how did he rise to power? The year was 1971 when Idi Amin came to power in Uganda, making Museveni flee to Tanzania in exile. While in Tanzania, though, he founded the Front for National Salvation, which helped in overthrowing Amin in 1979. In 1980, he ran for presidency but lost to his great competitor Milton Obote. The then elections though were believed to have been rigged countrywide, which saw Museveni and the former president, Yusuf Lule, merging to form NRM, the National Resistance Movement. Being in charge of NRM, Museveni led the group in a guerrilla war against Milton Obote's regime. Um. The resistance eventually prevailed and on January 26, 1986, Museveni declared himself president of Uganda. He was elected to the post on May 9, 1996, and his backers won control of the National Assembly, eliminating term limits for the presidency. This saw him running for the same seat in 2001 and 2006, which he won without much struggle. He was re-elected once more in 2011 and 2016, although the opposition and international observers noted problems with the polling process in both elections. A constitutional amendment passed in 2017 removed the age limit for presidential candidates that had been set at age 75 clearing the way for an aging Museveni to stand for the next two presidential elections. He was re-elected in 2021, but again the campaign period prior to the polls was criticized as being repressive. To date, Yoweri Kaguta Museveni is still Uganda's president. What a ride for him! That was it about Museveni's rise to power. My name is Nokla Murunga, Africa Rebirth.